Hey, it's Rebecca with Rain Nail Studio, and today we're doing a gel manicure. All right, first we're just pushing back the cuticles to start our prep. Then I am taking a 240 grit nail file to shape the nails. She did not want her nails trimmed. A few of them are quite short, but she's just letting them grow out. So we did skip that step, but we're just getting them shaped and filed. And now I'm going to start working on the cuticles. I am taking my Melody Susie drill and using this pointy drill bit. I don't know what this is called, but this is my favorite drill bit for helping with cuticle care. It's really important that you remind your clients to use cuticle oil regularly so that we don't have to focus so much maintenance on the cuticles or that they have dry, brittle cuticles. So just remember to always throw that in there to use cuticle oil regularly. Next, I'm going in with my sanding band. Make sure that your sanding band is fine because sometimes with these bags, they just throw any type in there and you don't want to use anything too rough. And I did prep the band on my nail file just to smooth it out just a little bit. And here I'm just getting as close to the cuticle area as possible and also getting all of that oil and extra debris off of the nail bed. Here I am trimming off a lot of the dead cuticles. Not every client is going to need cuticle work, so just keep that in mind. You just want to make sure that you're cutting off dead skin, not getting too close to the live epinicium. I did skip primer on this gel manicure. I just wanna see how long they will last. These are my mom's nails and she can go two months without a fill or a new gel manicure. Her nails last a really long time. But I'm going in with my Madame Glam gel base coat. And I do have a code for Madame Glam. It's Rebecca30, that's Rebecca with one C. Be sure to check them out. You can get 30% off of your order with that code. And I do cure these for 90 seconds just to be on the safe side.
The color we are using today is Creamy Macaroon by DND. And if you don't know already, I love buying these from DTKNailSupply.com. I will go ahead and leave them down below. I do not have a discount code for them. I just really love this company because the shipping is fast and they have great deals on all of their products. Just be sure that when you're polishing with gel polish, you use thin coats so that way it'll cure evenly. All right, lastly, I'm going in with the Madame Glam Top Coat, and I am making sure to coat that free edge so that we can avoid chipping as much as possible. And these are not thick coats, but they are just a little bit heavier than I would normally go in, just because this is the top coat and I want it to coat evenly. Being sure to get rid of that sticky layer, I am taking a no lint wipe and some alcohol to clean off the nails. Then I'm going in with my homemade cuticle oil just to moisten up the cuticle area a bit since we've cleansed and wiped so much. 